them seven games. Miles Robinson playing on the left-hand side of the three. How does that change things for him? I think he'll be fine. He's a player that we've seen be more comfortable oh, in. Araujo turning on the Jets. Luis Araujo racing clear. Can he finish? Yes, he can! Oh, that is spectacular! The Samba sensation! Welcome to Major League Soccer, Luis Araujo! Araujo delivers. Great ball! Chance for Martinez! Goal! Smart pass from Franco to Barco. Now Martinez. Martinez! Cool as you like! Can he make it happen? Yes, he can! Pick it out! Ezekiel Barco! Putting an FC Cincinnati side to the sword. A Cincinnati side that came here and made six changes. And that does it! Three big points once more for Atlanta United. Tees it up to the left to Teton. Medina. Inside of the 18, headed down, comes out for Tor Aronson. Goody Tor Aronson back into the 18, and an equalizer is there. Keaton Parks finds the header. New York City draws even. Looking to make a big save. Castellanos looking to put New York City on top. Castellanos pushes it past Teton, and New York City leads 2-1 to one on the road. Putting his hands on someone's neck after all of it happened. And he's not even going to put the ball back into play. Ted Uncle has seen enough. The match is blown dead. Full-time whistle in Cincinnati. New York City win. This is Flores for Gressel. Opportunities here. It sizzles across. It's in the net. It is in the net. Oh, Ariola. He has scored. And DC has the lead. Julian Gressel. Sending it in. Tomorrow, Flores lets go to Gressel. Gressel sending it in. Ariola the strike. Oh yes! Oh yes! It's in the net. It is in the net. Number two for Ariola tonight. Now he's off. Oh. Wow! Nigel Roberta has scored. Nigel Roberta has scored. Save, and that's it. DC United, should I say escapes, with a 4-2 win over FC Cincinnati. It's Jacob Shackleburn! Toronto FC level, two minutes after halftime as Jacob Shackleburn gets the goal. Shackleburn there as well. Shackleburn with a lovely ball in, Delgado! Two goals in the opening ten minutes of the second half. He's got support from Schaffelberg there. Rolls it through for Schaffelberg. A challenge in the middle. A challenge with the goal. TFC with three in the second half. And now incomplete. Referee Sylvia Petrescu. Wonder why he's wearing that stop watch. Toronto FC move off the foot of the Eastern Com. You have to think for. Liberal supporters tonight, a very important one. Koopman gets it in the 18. Turns, takes a shot, and the former FC Cincinnati man strikes against his former club. More so just New York screaming for a whistle. Hagelin into the 18, and it sails into the hands of Cornell. A full-time whistle in Cincinnati and a massive result for New York. Three needed points for the Red Bulls. McGlynn into the box, Aronson. Turns it across the 18. It falls to Shabilko. Turns and takes a shot. Katzper Shabilko has his 10th goal of the season. And Philadelphia. Jack Elliott. On to Harriel on the near side. Harriel into the 18. Far post. Aronson is there. And Aronson beats Teton. He stayed on side. 2 0 Philadelphia. Last chance for Cincinnati. Across the box. Atonga closing in. It'll bounce out on the end line. And let's see if that is it. Acosta falls to the pitch, knowing that may have been the last chance, and it was full-time whistle in Cincinnati. You have to think for 
Liberal supporters tonight, a very important one. Koopman gets it in the 18, turns, takes a shot, and the former FC Cincinnati man strikes against his former club. New York screaming for a whistle. Haglin into the 18, and it sails into the hands of Cornell. A full-time whistle in Cincinnati and a massive result for New York. Three needed points for the Red Bulls. On to the right side, Huan. Huan into the 18 with Hagelin in his face. Huan will drop it back. Urso, a shot that sneaks by Teton at the post. Another shot from distance. And Orlando gets on the board with a... Hagelin fires it into the box. Headed away by Urso. Full-time whistle. Orlando escapes with three points as boos rain down at TQL Stadium. Over to Navarro. Back to the left side of Madron. Working his way towards the 18. Looking for a pass. Comes out. Teton makes the save. Barrich is there on the follow. After Pineda's shot was saved, Barrich puts Chicago on top in the first. Herbers into the box. Off to the foot of Alisada. Teton! Spills the ball off his hand, couldn't get it. Barrett taps it in, and an early brace for Robert Barrett. A just looking between the Costa and George Allen. That well, there is that little gap as well. Madron, the native of Spain, steps to the ball, strikes it with his right foot, and puts it in the top shelf, out of the reach of Shemichwav Teton. Chicago back on top, 3-2. Great character, balling back into the game. Trail twice, came from behind, twice in Chicago! A rocket off the foot of Luka Stojanovic retakes the lead! Chicago screaming for a full-time whistle, and they get it. A massive win for the Fire, who strike at the death after Cincinnati had equalized. Flag will stay down as Pizarro just about keeping it in play. Pulls up. Pizarro. The goal is towards Federico Iguain, and it's the opener. He's done it again in the starting lineup and on the score sheet for two matches on the bounce. And Miami lead in the sixth minute. Um, and even some players who are out there as Federico gets across and towards Gonzalo Iguain. And it's a one. Brother to brother. The Iguain connection has fired Miami back into the lead. A run out of Cruz, Magic. who commits and doesn't get him, just has to play the next pass. Brilliant. It's Vasilev, Indiana Vasilev on his right, and it's 3 1. Indiana Vasilev with a screamer of a goal. He had the entire goal to aim at and picks out. But Dunyan in with the challenge and free kick, kick it quickly, and now it's 3 3. Morgan plays him in. The Morgan bounce. for four. That was from Pizarro, and now Higuain is turning in for Carranza. Can they go for five anywhere? They have! That one should count! Oh, they they Julian Carranza has opened his 2021 account! And have a wonderful study. And there is the full-time whistle. Into Miami for the first time in club history. have hit for five. They've scored eight in two matches, and tonight with five different goal scorers. Mukhtar. Sends it into the 18. Headed down and past Vermeer. Walker Zimmerman on the header. Set piece goal to Nashville. Leal and Randall Leal has another goal against Cincinnati. Three to two. Yeah, just, that's just shooting 40 yards away. Mukhtar into the 18. Zimmerman on the header and it's pushed past Vermeer. CJ Sapong finds an equalizer for Nashville. 3-3 in Cincinnati. To deflection. Anunga on a shot. Deflects out to Lauber. Right at the edge of the 18. Bailey in his face. Mukhtar. Andy Mukhtar. Back to Leal who beats Kenneth Vermeer. Nashville has come back to take a 4-3 advantage. Three across the midfield. Lauba all alone on the goalkeeper. Lauba turns, strikes. Nashville leads by a pair.
The flag stayed down. And at this stage, Tommy, you just hop. Breaking free once again. Lauba into the 18. Turns on Blackett. Leaves it off for CJ Sapong. Sapong turns and scores in stoppage time. Understands the that draw for Philadelphia. Nashville now moves up to the two seed in the Eastern Conference. Full time whistle sounds. Five unanswered goals for Nashville as they have clinched a spot in the 2021 MLS Cup playoffs. He's down for the moment. Pedroia with options, going to play it back. Baizo with the rocket, he scores! The first career goal for Olivier Baizo! 1-0 Union! McGlynn looking inside for Aronson, got it on his left, packs it, Aronson scores again against FC Cincinnati! Aronson shines! By the closest player there for the Union. And I get another shutout for Andre Blake. There's the whistle by Bazakos. And the Union move in the second place in the Eastern Conference with one game to go. The French Verde boots, he sends it in. Oh, it's a miscue and a goal! The breakthrough! It didn't take long to arrive. Season number... Well, one by Lima, who's hooked it in and ring... A scorch! Alex Ring down into the ground and over Alex Can. They were appealing for offside. The flag stayed down and Alex Ring. And now for Gundes. Going to keep it on the ground. Diego for Gundes. Nicely done. Back to him. All the way to for Gundes. And Driussi. Sebastian Driussi! It gets better and better for Austin FC in this first half of the season. They can switch. Pat Noonan as Driussi tries to hunt this down and he may do so. Driussi is through and Cecilio Dominguez! 4-0 Austin FC. On the run. Controlling the right-hand side. Great skill from him. GT. Oh, he scored! It may go down as an own goal, but GT is going to take all the plaudits. Move. Oh. Kamara in stoppage time from the spot, slots it past Alec Can. 1 0 DC. And what a changing of momentum in the Queen City. And disbelief for the hosts. As he steps, again, Alec Khan. Guesses the right way, gets down to his right hand side, but Kamara just had too much pace on it. Absolutely heartbreaking for FC Cincinnati and these fans. DC will be screaming for a full time whistle, but come on, there have been a lot of factors that tack down a few more minutes. Murphy towards the 18. Cameron is there on the header. I mean, a huge save for DC at the death. Costa with a touch is lost. And there is the full-time whistle. Cincinnati falls 1-0 in the home opener, D.C. Build the puck. One finds its way to Acosta, threads in Vasquez! Cincinnati takes the lead! The first goal of the season for FC Cincinnati. And it's Brandon Vasquez who finds the back of the net. Actually, and Luan gets knocked down. Play on for the moment. Baji with the cross. It's 2 1. They'll have a look at it for the potential foul on Baji, but this could very well stand in Cincinnati retaking the lead. Not even. Nope. FC Cincinnati snaps their 14 game losing streak with a win.